In theoretical physics and mathematical physics, analytical mechanics, or theoretical mechanics is a collection of closely related alternative formulations of classical mechanics. It was developed by many scientists and mathematicians during the 18th century and onward, after Newtonian mechanics. Since Newtonian mechanics considers vector quantities of motion, particularly accelerations, momenta, forces, of the constituents of the system, an alternative name for the mechanics governed by Newton's laws and Euler's laws is vectorial mechanics. By contrast, analytical mechanics uses scalar properties of motion representing the system as a whole usually its total kinetic energy and potential energy not Newton's vectorial forces of individual particles. A scalar is a quantity, whereas a vector is represented by quantity and direction. The equations of motion are derived from the scalar quantity by some underlying principle about the scalar's variation. Analytical mechanics takes advantage of a system's constraints to solve problems. The constraints limit the degrees of freedom the system can have, and can be used to reduce the number of coordinates needed to solve for the motion. The formalism is well suited to arbitrary choices of coordinates, known in the context as generalized coordinates. The kinetic and potential energies of the system are expressed using these generalized coordinates or momenta, and the equations of motion can be readily set up, thus analytical mechanics allows numerous mechanical problems to be solved with greater efficiency than fully vectorial methods. It does not always work for non-conservative forces or dissipative forces like friction, in which case one may revert to Newtonian mechanics or use the eudwadia kalaba equation. Two dominant branches of analytical mechanics are Lagrangian mechanics using generalized coordinates and corresponding generalized velocities in configuration space and Hamiltonian mechanics using coordinates and corresponding momenta in phase space. Both formulations are equivalent by a Legendre transformation on the generalized coordinates, velocities and momenta, therefore both contain the same information for describing the dynamics of a system. There are other formulations such as Hamilton-Jacobi theory, Routhian mechanics, and Appel's equation of motion. All equations of motion for particles and fields, in any formalism, can be derived from the widely applicable result called the principle of least action. One result is Noether's theorem, a statement which connects conservation laws to their associated symmetries. Analytical mechanics does not introduce new physics and is not more general than Newtonian mechanics. Rather it is a collection of equivalent formalisms which have broad application. In fact the same principles and formalisms can be used in relativistic mechanics and general relativity, and with some modification, quantum mechanics and quantum field theory. Analytical mechanics is used widely, from fundamental physics to applied mathematics, particularly chaos theory. The methods of analytical mechanics apply to discrete particles, each with a finite number of degrees of freedom. They can be modified to describe continuous fields or fluids, which have infinite degrees of freedom. The definitions and equations have a close analogy with those of mechanics. Intrinsic motion Generalized coordinates and constraints in Newtonian mechanics, one customarily uses all three Cartesian coordinates, or other 3D coordinate system, to refer to a body's position during its motion. In physical systems, however, some structure or other system usually constrains the body's motion from taking certain directions and pathways. So a full set of Cartesian coordinates is often unneeded, as the constraints determine the evolving relations among the coordinates, which relations can be modeled by equations corresponding to the constraints. In the Lagrangian and Hamiltonian formalisms, the constraints are incorporated into the motion's geometry, reducing the number of coordinates to the minimum needed to model the motion. These are known as generalized coordinates, denoted chi I equals 1, 2, 3. Difference between curvilinear and generalized coordinates Generalized coordinates incorporate constraints on the system. There is one generalized coordinate chi for each degree of freedom for convenience labeled by an index i equals 1, 2, n, i.e. each way the system can change its configuration, as curvilinear lengths or angles of rotation. Generalized coordinates are not the same as curvilinear coordinates. 
The number of curvilinear coordinates equals the dimension of the position space in question, usually 3 for 3D space. While the number of generalized coordinates is not necessarily equal to this dimension, constraints can reduce the number of degrees of freedom, hence the number of generalized coordinates required to define the configuration of the system following the general rule. Dimension of position space, usually 3 times number of constituents of system particles minus number of constraints. Topic. Number of degrees of freedom Number of generalized coordinates For a system with n degrees of freedom, the generalized coordinates can be collected into an n-tuple q equals q 1 q 2 q n Display style math bf q equals q underscore one q underscore two c d o t s q underscore n, and the time derivative here denoted by an overdo of this tuple give the generalized velocities d q d t equals d q one d t d Q two D T D Q N D T Q equals Q one Q two Q N Display style FRAC D Math BF Q DT equals left FRAC DQ underscore one DT FRAC DQ underscore two DT CDOTS FRAC DQ underscore N DT right equiv Math BF dot Q equals dot Q underscore one dot Q underscore two CDOTS dot Q underscore N D'Alembert's principle The foundation which the subject is built on is D'Alembert's principle. This principle states that infinitesimal virtual work done by a force across reversible displacements is zero, which is the work done by a force consistent with ideal constraints of the system. The idea of a constraint is useful, since this limits what the system can do, and can provide steps to solving for the motion of the system. The equation for D'Alembert's principle is delta w equals q delta q equals 0 display style delta w equals bold symbol math call q c d o t delta math b f q equals 0 where q equals q 1 q 2 q n Display style bold symbol math call q equals math call q underscore one math call q underscore two c d o t s math call q underscore n are the generalized forces script q instead of ordinary q is used here to prevent conflict with canonical transformations below and q are the generalized coordinates. This leads to the generalized form of Newton's laws in the language of analytical mechanics. Q equals D D T T Q minus T Q display style bold symbol math call Q equals frac mathrm D mathrm D T left frac partial T partial math BF dot Q right frac partial T partial math BF Q where T is the total kinetic energy of the system, and the notation Q equals Q one Q two Q N Display style FRAC partial partial math BF Q equals left FRAC partial partial Q underscore one FRAC partial partial Q underscore two C D O T S FRAC partial partial Q underscore N right is a useful shorthand see matrix calculus for this notation. Holonomic constraints 
If the curvilinear coordinate system is defined by the standard position vector r, and if the position vector can be written in terms of the generalized coordinates q and time t in the form r equals r q t t display style math bf r equals math bf r math bf q t t and this relation holds for all times t, then q are called holonomic constraints. Vector r is explicitly dependent on t in cases when the constraints vary with time, not just because of q t. For time-independent situations, the constraints are also called scleronomic, for time-dependent cases they are called rheonomic. <laughs> Lagrangian mechanics Lagrangian and Euler-Lagrange equations The introduction of generalized coordinates and the fundamental Lagrangian function L Q Q T equals T Q Q T minus V Q Q T Display style L Math BF Q Math BF dot Q T equals T Math BF Q Math BF dot Q T V Math BF Q Math BF dot Q T where T is the total kinetic energy and V is the total potential energy of the entire system, then either following the calculus of variations or using the above formula, lead to the Euler Lagrange equations D D T L Q equals L Q display style frac d dt left frac partial L partial math bf dot Q right equals frac partial L partial math bf Q which are a set of n second order ordinary differential equations, one for each g t. This formulation identifies the actual path followed by the motion as a selection of the path over which the time integral of kinetic energy is least, assuming the total energy to be fixed, and imposing no conditions on the time of transit. Configuration space The Lagrangian formulation uses the configuration space of the system, the set of all possible generalized coordinates c equals q element of r n display style math call c equals math bf q in math b r caret n where r n display style math b r caret n is n dimensional real space see also set builder notation the particular solution to the euler lagrange equations is called a configuration path or trajectory ie one particular q t subject to the required initial conditions the general solutions form a set of possible configurations as functions of time q t element of r n t 0 t element of r C display style math bf q t in math b r caret n t g e q zero t in math b r subset ec math call c. The configuration space can be defined more generally and indeed more deeply in terms of topological manifolds and the tangent bundle. Topic: Hamiltonian mechanics. Hamiltonian and Hamilton's equations The Legendre transformation of the Lagrangian replaces the generalized coordinates and velocities q, q, with q, p, the generalized coordinates and the generalized momenta conjugate to the generalized coordinates p equals l q equals l q 1 l q 2 l q n equals p 1 p 2 p n 
Display style Math BF P equals FRAC partial L partial Math BF dot Q equals left FRAC partial L partial dot Q underscore one FRAC partial L partial dot Q underscore two C D O T S FRAC partial L partial dot Q underscore N right equals P underscore one P underscore two C D O T S P underscore N and introduces the Hamiltonian, which is in terms of generalized coordinates and momenta H Q P T equals P Q minus L Q Q T Display style H Math BF Q Math BF P T equals Math BF P C D O T Math BF dot Q L Math BF Q Math BF dot Q T Where denotes the dot product, also leading to Hamilton's equations P equals minus H Q Q equals plus H P display style math BF dot P equals frac partial H partial math BF Q quad math BF dot Q equals plus frac partial H partial math BF P which are now a set of two n first order ordinary differential equations one for each chi T and pi T another result from the Legendre transformation relates the time derivatives of the Lagrangian and Hamiltonian D H D T equals minus L T display style frac D H D T equals frac partial L partial T, which is often considered one of Hamilton's equations of motion, additionally to the others. The generalized momenta can be written in terms of the generalized forces in the same way as Newton's second law. P equals q display style math bf dot p equals bold symbol math call q generalized momentum space analogous to the configuration space the set of all momenta is the momentum space technically in this context generalized momentum space m equals p element of r n Display style math call m equals math bf p in math b r caret n momentum space also refers to k space the set of all wave vectors given by de Broglie relations as used in quantum mechanics and theory of waves this is not referred to in this context phase space the set of all positions and momenta form the phase space p equals c times m equals q p element of r 2 n display style math call p equals math call c times math call m equals math bf q math bf p in math b r caret 2 n that is the cartesian product times of the configuration space and generalized momentum space a particular solution to Hamilton's equations is called a phase path, a particular curve Q t, p t, subject to the required initial conditions. The set of all phase paths, the general solution to the differential equations, is the phase portrait Q t p t element of R 2 n t 0 t element of r p display style math bf q t math bf p t in math b r caret 2 n t g e q 0 t in math b r subset math call p the poisson bracketal dynamical variables can be derived from position r momentum p and time t and written as a function of these a equals a q p t if a q p t and b q p t are two scalar valued dynamical variables the poisson bracket is defined by the generalized coordinates and momenta a b 
a b q p equals a q b p minus a p b q K A Q K B P K minus A P K B Q K display style begin aligned A B equiv A B underscore math B F Q math B F P and equals frac partial A partial math B F Q C D O T frac partial B partial math B F P frac partial A partial math B F P C D O T frac partial B partial math B F Q and equiv sum underscore K FRAC partial A partial Q underscore K FRAC partial B partial P underscore K FRAC partial A partial P underscore K FRAC partial B partial Q underscore K end aligned Calculating the total derivative of one of these, say A, and substituting Hamilton's equations into the result leads to the time evolution of A D A D T equals A H plus a T display style frac da d t equals A H plus frac partial A partial T. This equation in A is closely related to the equation of motion in the Heisenberg picture of quantum mechanics, in which classical dynamical variables become quantum operators indicated by hats and the Poisson bracket is replaced by the commutator of operators via Dirac's canonical quantization A B 1 I A caret B caret Display style a b right arrow frac one i h b a r hat a hat b. Topic: Properties of the Lagrangian and Hamiltonian functions. Following are overlapping properties between the Lagrangian and Hamiltonian functions. All the individual generalized coordinates chi t, velocities q, i t, and momenta pi t for every degree of freedom are mutually independent. Explicit time dependence of a function means the function actually includes time t as a variable in addition to the q t, p, t, not simply as a parameter through q t and p, t, which would mean explicit time independence. The Lagrangian is invariant under addition of the total time derivative of any function of q and t, that is L equals L plus D D T F Q T Display style L equals L plus FRAC D D T F Math BF Q T so each Lagrangian L and L describe exactly the same motion. In other words, the Lagrangian of a system is not unique. Analogously, the Hamiltonian is invariant under addition of the partial time derivative of any function of q, p, and t, that is, k equals h plus t g q p t. Display style k equals h plus frac partial partial t g math bf q math bf p t. K is a frequently used letter in this case. This property is used in canonical transformations. See below. If the Lagrangian is independent of some generalized coordinates, then the generalized momenta conjugate to those coordinates are constants of the motion, i.e., are conserved. This immediately follows from Lagrange's equations. L Q J equals zero D P J D T equals D D T L Q J equals zero 
Display style FRAC partial L partial Q underscore J equals zero right arrow FRAC DP underscore J DT equals FRAC D DT FRAC partial L partial dot Q underscore J equals zero. Such coordinates are cyclic or ignorable. It can be shown that the Hamiltonian is also cyclic in exactly the same generalized coordinates. If the Lagrangian is time independent, the Hamiltonian is also time independent, i.e., both are constant in time. If the kinetic energy is a homogeneous function of degree 2 of the generalized velocities, and the Lagrangian is explicitly time independent, then T lambda Q I 2 lambda Q J lambda Q K Q equals lambda two T Q I two Q J Q K Q L Q Q Display style t lambda dot q underscore i caret two lambda dot q underscore j lambda dot q underscore k math bf q equals lambda caret two t dot q underscore i caret two dot q underscore j dot q underscore k math bf q quad l math bf q math bf dot q where lambda is a constant, then the Hamiltonian will be the total conserved energy, equal to the total kinetic and potential energies of the system H equals T plus V equals E Display style H equals T plus V equals E This is the basis for the Schrödinger equation, inserting quantum operators directly obtains it. Topic. Principle of least action Action is another quantity in analytical mechanics defined as a functional of the Lagrangian S equals T 1 T 2 L Q Q T D T Display style math call s equals in underscore t underscore one carrot t underscore two l math bf q math bf dot q t dt. A general way to find the equations of motion from the action is the principle of least action. Delta s equals delta t one t two L Q Q T D T equals zero. Display style delta math call s equals delta in underscore t underscore one carrot t underscore two L math bf Q math bf dot Q T D T equals zero, where the departure t one and arrival t two times are fixed. The term path or trajectory refers to the time evolution of the system as a path through configuration space c display style math call c in other words qt tracing out a path in c display style math call c the path for which action is least is the path taken by the system from this principle all equations of motion in classical mechanics can be derived this approach can be extended to fields rather than a system of particles see below, and underlies the path integral formulation of quantum mechanics, and is used for calculating geodesic motion in general relativity. <laughs> Hamiltonian Jacobi mechanics Canonical transformations the invariance of the Hamiltonian under addition of the partial time derivative of an arbitrary function of p, q, and t allows the Hamiltonian in one set of coordinates q and momenta p to be transformed into a new set q. Topic: 
Q, Q, P, T, and P. P, Q, P, T, in four possible ways K, Q, P, T equals H, Q, P, T plus T, G, 1, Q, Q, T, K, Q, P, T equals H Q P T plus T G two Q P T K Q P T equals H Q P T plus T G three P Q T K Q P T equals H Q P T plus T G four P P T Display style begin aligned and K Math BF Q Math BF P T equals H Math BF Q Math BF P T plus FRAC partial partial T G underscore one Math BF Q Math BF Q T and K Math BF Q Math BF P T equals H Math BF Q Math BF P T plus FRAC partial partial T G underscore two Math BF Math Q Math BF P T and K Math BF Q Math BF P T equals H Math BF Q Math BF P T plus FRAC partial partial T G underscore three Math BF P Math BF Q T and K Math BF Q Math BF P T equals H Math BF Q Math BF P T plus FRAC partial partial T G underscore four Math B Bf p math bf p t end aligned with the restriction on p and q such that the transformed Hamiltonian system is p equals minus k q q equals plus k p display style math bf dot p equals frac partial k partial math bf q quad math bf dot q equals plus frac partial k partial math bf p the above transformations are called canonical transformations each function g n is called a generating function of the nth kind or type n. The transformation of coordinates and momenta can allow simplification for solving Hamilton's equations for a given problem. The choice of q and p is completely arbitrary, but not every choice leads to a canonical transformation. One simple criterion for a transformation q q and p p to be canonical is the Poisson bracket b unity q i p i equals one display style q underscore i p underscore i equals one for all i equals one two n. If this does not hold, then the transformation is not canonical. The Hamilton-Jacobi equation B setting the canonically transformed Hamiltonian k equals zero, and the type two generating function equal to Hamilton's principal function, also the action s display style math call s plus an arbitrary constant c g two q t equals s q t plus C display style G underscore 2 math BF Q T equals math call s math BF Q T plus C the generalized momenta become P equals s Q display style math BF P equals frac partial math call s partial math BF Q and p is constant, then the Hamiltonian Jacobi equation H J E can be derived from the type two canonical transformation H equals minus S T 
Display style h equals frac partial math call s partial t, where h is the Hamiltonian as before. H equals h q p t equals h q s q t. Display style h equals h math bf q math bf p t equals h left math bf q frac partial math call s partial math bf q t right. Another related function is Hamilton's characteristic function. W q equals s q t plus e t display style w math bf q equals math call s math bf q t plus e t used to solve the hje by additive separation of variables for a time independent hamiltonian h the study of the solutions of the hamilton jacobi equations leads naturally to the study of symplectic manifolds and symplectic topology in this formulation, the solutions of the Hamilton-Jacobi equations are the integral curves of Hamiltonian vector fields. Routhian mechanics Routhian mechanics is a hybrid formulation of Lagrangian and Hamiltonian mechanics, not often used but especially useful for removing cyclic coordinates. If the Lagrangian of a system has s cyclic coordinates q, topic q1, q2, qs with conjugate momenta p, p1, p2, ps with the rest of the coordinates non-cyclic and denoted zeta equals zeta1, zeta1. Zeta n minus s, they can be removed by introducing the Routhian R equals P Q minus L Q P Zeta Zeta Display style R equals Math BF P C D O T Math BF dot Q L Math BF Q Math BF P bold symbol Zeta dot bold symbol Zeta which leads to a set of two's Hamiltonian equations for the cyclic coordinates Q Q equals plus R P P equals minus R Q display style dot math bf q equals plus frac partial r partial math bf p quad dot math bf p equals frac partial r partial math bf q and n minus s Lagrangian equations in the non-cyclic coordinates zeta d d t r zeta equals r Zeta display style frac d dt frac partial r partial dot bold symbol zeta equals frac partial r partial bold symbol zeta. Set up in this way, although the Routhian has the form of the Hamiltonian, it can be thought of a Lagrangian with n minus s degrees of freedom. The coordinates q do not have to be cyclic. The partition between which coordinates enter the Hamiltonian equations and those which enter the Lagrangian equations is arbitrary. It is simply convenient to let the Hamiltonian equations remove the cyclic coordinates, leaving the non-cyclic coordinates to the Lagrangian equations of motion. Topic: <laughs> Appellian mechanics. Appel's equation of motion involved generalized accelerations, the second time derivatives of the generalized coordinates alpha r equals q r equals d 2 q r d t 2 Display style alpha underscore r equals d d o t q underscore r equals frac d caret two q underscore r d t caret two. 
as well as generalized forces mentioned above in D'Alembert's principle. The equations are Q R equals S alpha R S equals one two K equals one N M K A K two Display style math call Q underscore R equals FRAC partial S partial alpha underscore R quad S equals FRAC one two sum underscore K equals one carrot N M underscore K math BF underscore K carrot two where A K equals R K equals D two R K D T two display style math bf underscore k equals d d o t math bf r underscore k equals frac d caret two math bf r underscore k d t caret two is the acceleration of the k particle, the second time derivative of its position vector. Each acceleration ack is expressed in terms of the generalized accelerations alpha r. Likewise, each r k are expressed in terms of the generalized coordinates q r. Topic: <laughs> Extensions to classical field theory. Lagrangian field theory generalized coordinates apply to discrete particles. For n scalar fields phi i r t, where i equals 1, 2, n, the Lagrangian density is a function of these fields and their space and time derivatives, and possibly the space and time coordinates themselves. L equals L phi 1 phi 2 phi 1 phi 2 phi 1 t phi 2 t r t display style math call l equals math call l phi underscore 1 phi underscore 2 l dots nabla phi underscore 1 nabla phi underscore 2 l dots partial phi underscore 1 partial t partial phi underscore 2 partial t l dots math bf r t and the Euler Lagrange equations have an analog for fields mu l mu phi i equals l phi i display style partial underscore mu left frac partial math call l partial partial underscore mu phi underscore i right equals frac partial math call l partial phi underscore i where mu denotes the four gradient and the summation convention has been used. For n scalar fields, these Lagrangian field equations are a set of n second order partial differential equations in the fields, which in general will be coupled and nonlinear. This scalar field formulation can be extended to vector fields, tensor fields, and spinner fields. The Lagrangian is the volume integral of the Lagrangian density L equals V L d v display style l equals int underscore math call v math call l dv originally developed for classical fields the above formulation is applicable to all physical fields in classical quantum and relativistic situations such as newtonian gravity classical electromagnetism general relativity and quantum field theory it is a question of determining the correct lagrangian density to generate the correct field equation Hamiltonian field theory the corresponding momentum field densities conjugate to the n scalar fields phi i r t r pi i r t equals l phi i phi i phi i t 
Display style pi underscore i math bf r t equals frac partial math call l partial dot phi underscore i quad dot phi underscore i equiv frac partial phi underscore i partial t, where in this context the overdo denotes a partial time derivative, not a total time derivative. The Hamiltonian density h display style math call h is defined by analogy with mechanics h phi 1 phi 2 pi 1 pi 2 r t equals i equals 1 n phi i r t pi i r t minus l display style math call h phi underscore 1 phi underscore 2 l dots pi underscore 1 pi underscore 2 l dots math bf r t equals sum underscore i equals 1 caret n dot phi underscore i math bf r t pi underscore i math bf r t math call l the equations of motion are phi i equals plus delta h delta pi i pi i equals minus delta h delta phi i Display style dot phi underscore i equals plus frac delta math call h delta pi underscore i quad dot pi underscore i equals frac delta math call h delta phi underscore i, where the variational derivative delta delta phi i equals phi i minus mu mu phi i display style frac delta delta phi underscore i equals frac partial partial phi underscore i partial underscore mu frac partial 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 underscore mu phi underscore i must be used instead of merely partial derivatives for n fields these hamiltonian field equations are a set of two n first order partial differential equations which in general will be coupled and nonlinear again the volume integral of the hamiltonian density is the hamiltonian h equals v h d v display style h equals int underscore math call v math call h d v Topic: Symmetry, conservation, and Noether's theorem. Symmetry transformations in classical space and time. Each transformation can be described by an operator, i.e., function acting on the position r or momentum p variables to change them. The following are the cases when the operator does not change r or p, i.e., symmetries, where r n theta is the rotation matrix about an axis defined by the unit vector n, an angle theta. Noether's theorem Oether's theorem states that a continuous symmetry transformation of the action corresponds to a conservation law, i.e. the action and hence the Lagrangian doesn't change under a transformation parameterized by a parameter s l q s t q s t equals l q t q t display style l q s t dot q s t equals l q t dot q t the lagrangian describes the same motion independent of s which can be length angle of rotation or time the corresponding momenta to q will be conserved Topic. See also Udwadia Kalaba equation, Applied mechanics, Classical mechanics, Dynamics, 
Hamilton Jacobi equation, Hamilton's principle, Kinematics, Kinetics, Physics, Non autonomous mechanics References and notes <references>